One day, there was a boy who was reading the book of Genesis, when all of a sudden there was an ostrich who popped out of the book, and the boy ran away to tell his friends. Hey, this scene is going to be on Osteogenesis Imperfecta, represented by this guy who was reading the book of Genesis over here when an ostrich all of a sudden popped out. Ostrich Genesis for Osteogenesis. Now, Osteogenesis Imperfecta is a genetic bone disorder, also known as brittle bone disease, and that's being represented by this guy over here. He's really excited to tell his friends about the ostrich that came out of the book, and he ran into this domino over here. So this can help us remember two things. The domino comes up in our autosomal dominant scenes, and this guy running into here and breaking his bones to help us remember the brittle bone disorders. So osteogenesis imperfecta results in bone problems, for example, multiple fractures, and is often confused with child abuse because a child will break so many bones. Now, how does this happen? Well, osteogenesis imperfecta is due to a problem most commonly in type of collagen type one. How do you remember that? Well, if you take a look over here, the boy, when he ran away, left his gun over here. And it's not any gun. It's one with a picture of college on it. He calls it the college gun. He forgot his college gun over there. The college gun is to help us remember collagen 1. Osteogenesis imperfecta is most commonly caused by a type 1 collagen defect. So as we discussed, that results in the bone problems. But there are other problems that also result. First of all, there's going to be a problem with the eye, the, and the uh, patient often presents with a blue sclera, hence this boy has a blue sclera. This is due to translucent connective tissue over the choroidal veins. Next, there's going to be dental defects, as we find he has dental defects, as we see over here, also known as dentogenesis imperfecta. This obviously is because teeth are formed from collagen, and since there's a problem with the collagen, it's going to cause teeth problems. Finally, we see that he has hearing aids to help us remember the conductive hearing loss, and specifically has icicles in ears. The icicles is in his ears is going to help us remember the abnormal ossicles often seen in osteogenesis imperfecta. Okay, there are different types of osteogenesis imperfecta, type 1, type 2, but that's not necessary for the boards, and therefore we're not going to get into it. But we will make a point that sometimes biphosphonates are given to reduce the risk of fracture, bone fracture. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this scene. I would be really happy if you would subscribe to the channel. Um, take care. Please leave your comments. Ask me any questions you like. Alrighty, enjoy.